Hey guys, so I'm sure most of you are aware of the copyright allegations against Freely the Banana Girl and uh, that there are claims that she stole footage and whatever. And uh, I'm here to say that she definitely stole something. And she stole something from lots of people and I'm I'm just I'm just saying that, like, you know what, I'm surprised because, you know, it, it didn't take me, like, a short time to realize that she, that she actually stole something from me, and I'm, I'm honestly, I'm, I'm baffled that she, that she stole this from me, and it's just so many, so many different people that she stole things from. And she, like, oh my god, I, I can't even fathom the fact that she stole this from me, and, like, you know what she stole from me? You know? You know? She stole my heart. Yeah. She stole my heart. Because, you know, <laughs> I was kind of vegetarian, pescatarian, uh, when I was 15 but you know it was it was only because I saw videos from PETA saying oh, all these poor animals how they're treated and whatever and yeah I was I was like that for many years and you know I I quit being like that uh, around 17 18 almost 18 and I started eating meat again and started with everything and you know, it it wasn't until a couple of years ago that I started watching Freely and I saw that, you know what? I don't have to do this for the animals. I can do this for my health. Because after watching Freely, I see that, you know, there are a lot of health benefits to being vegan and, you know, of course, one of the plus sides is that it's helping animals. But for some people, like me, that just isn't enough. When, especially when you have a low income, and there are a lot of delicious vegan options out there, but they are expensive. But you know, for my health, I chose this way because I realized, you know what, my health is really important and I'll just go for it and try to make my own vegan mock meats and whatever and it'll be a lot cheaper, I won't have to spend so much money on, on like, on you know, just a couple of dinners when I can, you know, have like a week worth of food and make my own. So, thank you Freely for showing me that, for showing me all the greatness that can come with being vegan. And Vegan Gains has also helped along my journey to show me that I can also be an athlete and also be vegan. So, you know, life is great, and my skin is a lot better than it used to be. I don't have as many red blotches as I used to, and my eczema is practically gone, and, you know, this life is great. Honestly, that's what I can say, and it's great, and I do recommend being vegan for anyone, <laughs> even if you're type O blood, whatever that these people say that, oh, you have to eat meat because you're type O blood. <laughs> I'm type O. And, you know, being vegan has been the best thing for my health. Okay, so, there you go. The only thing I was deficient in a few months ago was vitamin D, and I fixed that. I fixed that. I was never deficient in B12. So, there you go. I've just 
mustard. Mm, I must have busted all the myths. So, thank you freely for changing my life. Thank you, Bean Gains, for showing me that I can exercise a lot and, you know, still not, like, you know, have a heart attack. So, <laughs> thank you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! If you like that, please come back for more. Like, subscribe, and be sure to tell your friends to go vegan. <laughs> I swear it's not a chore. Love you guys. Bye.